just a small bump I'm born in four months you're born all right so I would say to start off with kind of your natural hair just because it's easier to mess around with and play with Anyway, for the first bun that I'm going to be doing is just like the typical messy bun. There's so many ways to do this, but there's so many ways to do messy buns, so I was like, why not? Okay, so what you do is you put your hands into claws, and pretty much you just like swoop your hair up with um, your hands, and if you don't get all your hair, it's okay, because you're going to put the rest up later anyways. Then, once you're done with that, take this hand, put it into a claw, and grab all the hair then grab your hair tie and literally just start putting it into a bun bam bam if your hair is kind of long like mine you might have like extra strands sticking out which you can just like tuck into your hair or you can get a bobby pin my hair is so thick it's so flimsy so sometimes I like to put two ponytails in and then I like to grab some hair to like frame my face a little bit just because I feel like it looks better. So anyways, that's the first bun. Um, it's kind of like... For the next bun, it's more of a top net kind of bun. So what we're going to do is pretty much slick, ba slick back most of your hair just because it looks the best when it's slicked back and then you put it up and then you mess around with it. So pretty much what we're going to do is kind of make sure you don't have any knots in your hair because you're pretty much going to make one. <laughs> um, so I would use two ponytails on this personally just because I have a lot of hair and it just works best for me. So we're literally what you're going to do is pinch with this with your right hand uh, on the ponytail and then twist with this one so twist 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 and then you're going to like twist around and around and you want to make it really tight just so you can mess with it later and then literally just put your hand over it and take your ponytails and put them around like this is like literally looks like a little tiny little bun on my head but I'm gonna take two ponytails I'm gonna use this one later though actually so then I'm gonna take a few hairs just to frame my face because I don't want to look bald alright so as you can see it's totally just like a little freaking thing on my head so what I'm gonna do is mess with it a bit but I'm going to be very light with it so I don't totally mess it up um, you're gonna have some flyaways if you have long hair as you can see but literally I'm just messing with it a tiny bit pulling a little bit because I still want it to have that um, t like little bun look but I want it to look a little bit more messy than a total ballerina bun on my head Just a small bump I'm born In four months you're brought to life And for the last one, it's pretty much what I'm doing is the same thing except I'm not slicking it back, I am clawing it. So you take all your hair, it's easier if you put it in the front because it just, it just stresses me. And then you take your hair, claw it up, claw the rest, make sure you're clawing it and not swooping it because if you claw it it makes it more messy and literally you can just keep clawing it until you get it to your desired like way take it all and I'm not doing this anymore like literally there's hairs that I'm like grabbing like sideways anyways I'm gonna twist it just a little bit and then um, do that but then I'm gonna like not really put it all together but I'm just gonna grab it if you guys see what I'm doing, take your ponytail. So I like twisted it and then I like put it into a bunch and then I just grabbed it right now. And then I'm just going to pin that up. It's so pretty much it just gives you this weird bun, random bun. Take another hair tie and do it again because sometimes they turn out really big and I don't like them that big. 
Anyways, this is my preferred messy pun. It's like one of the best ones, but it's the hardest one because I don't really know how to show you how to do it. I don't know if you saw that really well, but pretty much what I did is I did the same top net style. But as you can see, I like how it's going all different directions. weather and this season and I just cannot wait. It's Sunday so go Hawks. That's why I'm wearing a sweatshirt. I would have worn like a cute sweater for this but I was like I have to rep my Hawks so go Hawks and I hope we win the games on right now actually. Anyways I also wanted to thank you guys for freaking 14,000 subscribers like my goodness that's freaking crazy like it makes me feel so happy inside. Like, I'm literally dying inside right now. Like, literally. Anyways, it just makes me feel so accomplished. And, um, I'm sorry for my lack of videos. And I, like, realize, like, I have to get on to my game. Like, I am thinking and I'm like, what if I can post two videos a week? And this would probably be, like, one video would be, like, an outfit of the week's. Which I haven't started yet, and I'm sorry. Um, it's just hard because I have cheer right after school, and so then I change into my cheer stuff, and then I don't. And then when I get home, I don't want to change into, back into what I wore to school. So like, I'm gonna start um, doing them in the morning, and I'm gonna do it for this week. So that will probably be a video you'll see every week, and then also like a different kind of video, whatever I want to do. Hope you guys enjoy this video, and I hope you guys are just excited for this weather and season as I. And I hope you guys have a wonderful day and I love all of you guys and you guys are great and you're beautiful and I love you and yeah And I'll see you guys next time. Bye